Welcome to the Kalani Kart Circuit in Cape Town for round one of the South African Rotex Max Challenge, proudly brought to you by Rotex and Ed Murray Racing. Um, we did decent testing yesterday. We're pretty confident. Uh, obviously, with the super pole, it's very intense. I have to get solid lap in to obviously do well, and we managed to do that. So, looking forward to the race. Okay, and who's your biggest challenges here today? Um, well, top four seem very quick. Joseph Ulls, Yuri Swartz, Jason Kutsia. So today's going to be very tough for them. Yeah, so P2 in quali. Uh, my lap time, I decided not to work for the first time all weekend, so I threw my head off a little bit. I uh, made a small mistake on my second lap, but it's cool. It's still front row. Um, I think we've got the raw pace. We have very good race pace. And yesterday, the whole day, um, we, were, we would catch, chase them down. So. I think now just want to try and get to clear air in the front. I really feel like we can we can do it today. So it's unfortunate, but well done to Seb. He put it together when it mattered, and I made a mistake, and that's what separates us. So let's see what we can do. Well, obviously today we want to compete at a high level. We would like to run with the front pack, possibly collect a win along the way. Currently we're having some setup issues, um, but hopefully we'll have that fixed by race one. Um, but it's looking uh, quite tight right now. Um, well. <laughs> It's a race day as usual, you can't play your cards too early and plan ahead. Um, we'll just take it as it comes. I guess we do have really good pace. It's just the case of getting through to the front. So, yeah, let's see. Okay, your big competition today? Competition today, I think it's Umpi, Yuri Swart, um, Sebastian and Joseph Ors. So the plan is, um, I'm not. it's my first time here in DD2, so I mean do my best obviously I'm hoping for top three because when we go back to Benoni's side um yeah we've got it waxed that side so yeah yeah because you do a lot of laps at Benoni at the moment yeah I've been doing a lot of laps there I do driver training that side so um I mean I have to know that track off for heart so like, when we go over for the national we better turn change the circuit to give up a definitely good chance. <laughs> I've driven every circuit there so I mean <laughs> um well we just got to find a bit of pace we just uh point one off so Look, we just we happy at the setup with the cards that we have, so we just gonna we're gonna stick with it and uh, just try to perform the Oaks. Competition, where's that gonna come from? Look, there's a lot of competition here, especially from the Cape Tonians. You know, say home turf, so they do have the upper hand, but I'm pretty sure we'll be able to get there. It's, it's gonna be very close at the front. I mean, everyone's like separated by like 0.1, so it's whoever plays a smart game and doesn't uh, ride over each other, so we'll see how that goes. Hang on to the edge of your seat, folks. We're gonna go racing. This is gonna be out of the top draw. It's gonna be absolute mayhem. The fastest. These are some of the fastest lads in the world, if not well, in the country, if not the world. A lot of boys here, uh, young lads, have got bright futures ahead of them. Right, let's split the tram lines. And lights off and we go racing down towards turn number one. Who's going to get the whole shot? Boom, in they go. It looks like it could be Joey Ulf. Joey Ulf and Sebastian Boyd. I think it's Boyd. I think Boyd's got it. Swart's in there. Ulf's in third. Ulf is going to want to press. Young Joey Ulf at practice last year was blindingly quick. They hang around. Off they go. Sebastian Boyd last weekend looked a little bit humble. But can this young man pedal, folks? Out of box, Bendy goes, Yuri Swat, Umpi is his, uh, you'll see he'll have Umpini Motors, that is his own business on the side, followed there by Joey Ulf, Jason Kutsia, Wayland Wyman. They cross the line now to sort themselves out. Sebastian Luis over Yuri Swat, Joey Ulf, Wayland Wyman, Brandon Smith, Jason Kutsia, Divan Brock, Jamie Smith, Gil Samus, Nicholas Spirianis, Michael Jordan, and Nicholas Averis. Hello, are you Oaks awake? I'm talking to the, the track folks, not you viewers. I know you're awake because it's happening. Boy down into Cape Town in the golf club and Yuri Swartz there together with Joey. Oh, brilliant stuff. They hook out a golf club, they hang a left. Boyd hangs on in the 69 cart, in the 39 cart is a pin in the 11 there's Joey Ulf, as the old front three. They're all Cape Tonians. They are some of the quickest in the country folks. They are peddly. There's a challenge for fourth. There's a challenge for fourth. I think Brandon's gone up on Jason Kutsia. Kutsia comes through. Kutsia comes through. Kutsia's up to fourth. Yep, it's Jason Kutsia. I can see him from the control tower and I recognize the helmet. 
Could see him who's at the fourth. He wants to join a friend of his, Mr. Uh, Yuri Swartz, who sits in second. Umpi. Umpi's been chased there by Joey Uls. Joey Uls has got a white helmet. He used to don a beautiful gold helmet. I think I was asking for that helmet once. I want it. He can sign it. I'll keep it on the mantelpiece. But still, Semi Boy leads out there with the Umpi Swan. Followed there by Joey Uls. Jason Goodseer. Up behind Jason Goodseer. It's Brandon Smith. They make their way across the line. They still got 12, 13 laps to go. They've got two in the bag. Sounds like they're 200. My voice may last for the rest of the day. So still, Semi Boy leads out there with Yuri Swart and Joey Uls. The front three are nose to tail. You can throw a handkerchief over them. They're that close. As a matter of fact, I think they've got super glue between them. They roll out of their turn number four. Down the back straight. They go down towards Cape Town Corner. Boyd gets down. Swart gets down. Uls gets great drive. Coming out of the final corner down to Colts Cape Town. Jason Goods here. Then it's Brandon Smith, Waylon Wyman, and Jamie Smith are having a battle for five, six, and seven. Now there's a whole battle in the same game down into turn number one. Lovely. Lovely to see the squabbles. Hey, it's like a couple of women at the local superstore. What's the price? I want it. No, I want it. Now you can have it. No, I'm having it. Now you take it. In the meantime, while he's squabbling down the back straight goes Sebastian Boyd. Down into turn number five. Boyd down into the golf club. Joey Ulz. If Yuri Swart puts so much as a piece of trade wrong, Ulz is going to eat him up. Here comes Kutsia. Welcome to the party, Jason. It's about time, lad, because you've still got seven left left. Jason could see her from nowhere has turned up the volume button and it won't be long and he's going to be sitting up behind Joseph Ulf. He's a turn number two, the 180s. Still Sebastian Boy leads out there with Yuri Swart together with Joey Ulz and Jason could see her. Four Cape Townians in the lead, folks. I rest my case in DD2 seniors. Sebastian Boyd is starting to put a daylight between himself there and Yuri Swart. He rolls out a box, then here comes Yuri, comes Joey. And Jason. Jason Gutierrez says, you know what? I can actually do this. I've won here before. Many a time. Plenty. And I'm in fourth. Um, Joey, I'm going to throw a fishing line in the back of your car and reel in. I'm reeling in. Reeling in. Hello, Joey. I just drifted into the fourth spot here. I'm behind you. Joey, can you hear me? It's Jason here. Yeah. There we go. Yuri Swart trying to get away from Joey Ulz. Got a bit of breathing space. Ulz gets on the gas. Could see us pedaling. Look at him drifting into five. Look at his cart control. Stupendous. I call him Mr. Drifter in the karting. He drifts it into the corners. Say Boyd leads out. Yuri Swart. Joey Ulz. Jason could see her. That's your front four. Semi Boyd gets on the loud pedal. Puts his head beneath the wind. Makes it down towards Cape Town Corner. Into Golf Club. Here comes Kill Samus. Kill. They're coming for you, lad. Hurry up, because here comes Sebi Boyd, Yuri Swart, Joey Olsen, Jason Kutsia. And we got two laps. Two laps. We're having so much fun. I said we can do 200, but they got two laps. Last lap. It's the last lap. Sebi, keep it on the black stuff, boy. Out of turn number one into turn number two. Sebastian Boyd, nice and late on the break. Feeds it in. Oh, here comes Kutsia sliding it up behind. Is Jason going to pull the pin? Joey Olsen goes defensive. Kutsia's on an attack. All guns blazing, rockets are loaded. Here we go down towards Cape Town Corner. Kutsia's on it. Ulz is up for a fight. Kutsia drifts it in up on the inside of Ulz. They touch. Is Kutsia going to take third? Is Kutsia going to take third? No. Ulz holds it. Check it flag beckons. Check it flag beckons for that man. Semi Boy takes it from Yuri Swart, Joey Ulz and Jason Kutsia. Valent Wyman, five. Brandon Smith, Jamie Smith. Oh man, what a drive out of these young lads. Um, it went very well, obviously I won. Um, from the start, I had a decent start and then just kept my head down, made sure I was consistent and then just ended the race. Okay, any, any other challenges? How would others go? Um, we had a bit of a gap at the end, so obviously our pace was very strong, but I expect everyone else to catch up in race two and work a bit harder. Yeah, a bit underwhelming pace we had, but all respect to Sebi, held his own, kept on the pressure. They started developing a little misfire, I saw my starter was loose and some oil was spewing there. I think it maybe got into the plugs, but all in all, I think he still would have had it either way. He just had that edge on us, but it's cool, we'll go back, check the data and see what we can find. We had him yesterday, so we must see what changed to today. But otherwise, can't really complain too much, so we'll take it. Um, well, in the beginning, we didn't have as much uh, traction as Yuri, so... 
uh, he was able to take me around the outside going into the first corner. Um, and then from then onwards, unfortunately, we did not have um, enough pace to get in front of uh, Yuri. But credit to um, Boyd, he did, had an amazing race um, and he drove very well. Um, hopefully for, next, for the, next fo the following races, we can uh, change something so that we are able to match their pace. But uh, yeah, well done to him for this race. They work their way around towards the tram lines. Just going to get the gas early. They watch the lights. The lights are on. They break the tram lines. Lights off and away they go. Off they go. Who's going to the front? White or Sebastian Boyd? Boyd takes the front. And Upi Swat's in second. Yep. And who's got through? Jason Goodsear is in three. And Joey Ulse is getting mugged from every quarter of the field. And Sam gets on the gas and so do does Yuri and Jason. Is that Valen Wyman that got up there? We'll have a look see. Joey Ulse is back up there. Someone's off. Someone's off. Valen Wyman went off. He went wide out of golf club. I didn't see it. They crossed the line. Sam Boyd, Yuri Slot, Jason Gutierrez, Joey Ulse, Brandon Smith, Jamie Smith, Jesus Brianos, Lucas Zafiris. Steven Brock, Waylon Wyman, Michael Jordan, and Kelsimus. Oh, the gloves are off. 15 laps. Don't go anywhere. Stay in your chair. Things are unfolding. Sebastian Boyd, Yuri Swart. Here it comes. Now, Jason could see us in third. He's not being held up. What's going to happen? We're going to have to keep an eye on this one. Sebi Boyd, Yuri Swart, Jason could see us. Uh, Joey Ulz, Brandon Smith, Jamie Smith, Nick Spirianos, Nick Zafira, Stephen Brock, Valant, is Valant moving through the field? No, he's still down there lingering in third last. Front side, Semi Boyd, he's going to make it two out of two. Yuri Swart and Jason Kutsia moved to second. Yuri going to come back, Kutsia goes to second. Umbi Swart sits there in P3. They come out of turn number five down the back straight. And Semi Boyd's pulling away, Jason pursues him down towards Cape Town Corner into Golf Club. And suddenly Joey Hills is back in fourth. Out of Golf Club, Sam Boyd, Jason Gutierrez, Umpi Swat. I don't know if he'll be riding for championship or is he helping out Jason, because Jason's in second now, pursuing Sam Boyd. There is no love lost between those front four folks, nothing. They're all Cape Townians. They sit in front, dining to turn number two. Sam Boyd, Gutierrez, Swat, and Ulz. Also having a look at the back end of Swat. Swat was a lot quicker in heat number one. This time he's getting mugged from all quarters. Out of turn five, down the back straight they go. Down towards Cape Town corner. Sam Boyd's on the gas. Here comes Gutsia. Also up on the inside and Ulse makes it stick and relegates Swat to four. The question remains. Will Yuri go and scratch around in the top draw for some good racing? Down to turn one they go. They still got 11 laps to go. And good is a look at Boyd, and Boyd says, No, thank you, stay there, buddy. I'm leading, I belong here. You stay in second. Joey also is in third. This one is going to unfold into something special. Special indeed. They work it out at turn five down the back straight down towards Cape Town, and here comes Ulz. Ulz has a look at good but good dives across his bank. He's relatively honest in the golf club, out of golf club. Good see Ulz, Ulz is on fire. Ulz is on fire. Not literally, figuratively. Down towards turn one they go. Same point. Boy needs up. Good see in second. Joey Ulz, turn two. Good see slides into turn two. Same Boyd's uh, unaware of the drama that's unfolding behind him. Because Joey Ulz is up behind Jason Gutierrez. Yuri Swart, a little bit off the pace. Will he come back? Down towards Cape Town Corner. Here comes Kutsia. Kutsia reels up the back end of Boyd and says, Hello, I've come to play. So to Joey Ulz, the front three. No stick. Put a blanket over the three of them as they work their way out there. Boss Kios King. Take a right hand down towards turn number one. Nine laps to go. Nine in it. Seb Boyd's fighting for his supper at P1. Does the status quo remain? Is Kutsia going to slide into two? He does, but Ulz is with him. Here comes Swat. Here comes Umpi. Will Umpi do anything? And Ulz is through on Kutsia. Ulz goes to second. Oh my word. 
The two barrel of card cards in the front. Here we go. Here we go. I'm concentrating. What are they doing in those cards under those lids? Well, we'll have to wait and see. Into turn number two they go. Boyd leads out. Into three. Bulls is with him. Up into four. Left hand to five. Right hand out of five. Down the back straight. Still Boyd leads out. Joey Ulse is there with him. Ulse hard on the gas. Here comes Kutsia. Kutsia is on the money. Kutsia is on the money. He's trying to close down on the front too. He's got a few laps to do. Can he do it? Here comes Kutsia. Kutsia has found a little bit of pace. He's pushing hard. Boyd Ulse and here. That's your front three. Out of the final turn. Down towards the main. Turn number one. Down the main straight. Into one they go. Boyd leads out. Ulse is with him. Here comes Kutsia. Turn one, straighten up, down towards turn number two. Into two they go. Brilliant stuff. Turn two, horseshoe, three. Out of three, up towards four. Left and uh, left into four. Right out of five, down the back straight they go. Still Boyd leads out with Ulse there with him. Evenly matched. Ulse finds a bit of speed. Up behind Boyd. I mean, uh, yeah, Boyd, sorry. Boyd and Ulse changing paint. Kutsia looks on, best seat in the house at B3, they roll left, roll right, down the main straight, over the line, three uh, rounds to go, this is the DD2 seniors, but the shifters, they got gears, into uh, two, Boyd, Ulf, Kutsia, here comes Swat, is Swat going to have paint in the final closing stages, two laps in it, two and a bit, still Boyd and Ulf, now Ulf gets good speed, coming out of five now, he's right up behind Boyd, he's going to do something, Ulz looks on the inside and Ulz goes to one. Ulz goes to one ahead of Boyd for the first time today. Joey Ulz comes out of golf club. And Joey Ulz, you can't let him go to the front because he's going to pedal. And Boyd sits with him in the final lap. Gonna, well, penultimate lap. Penultimate lap. Boyd. Oh, and Ulz knocks Boyd right off the circuit. Boyd spins around and comes back on in about P4. That was uncalled for. If he was a gentleman, you let him come past. Penultimate lap. Boyd. Oh, and... Ulz knocks Boyd right off the circuit. Boyd spins around and comes back on in about P4. And uh, Ulz goes down to Cape Town Corner. Could see in second. Here comes uh, Boyd. Boyd back into three. He says to Yuri, thank you. Yuri lets him through. Boyd's in three. Last lap board coming out. Could see us in second. Boyd's in third. Boyd back in third trying to maintain points. Well... Ulz one, Kutsia two, Boyd three. Kutsia dives into two, slides it in out of three. Comes around three, goes to four. Ulz is quick, Kutsia is even quicker. Comes out the back straight, but I think Ulz has done enough to lead out and take this one. Boyd is in third, but I can assure you they better get a referee because someone's going to get a blood nose. Someone's going to get a blood nose. Ulz and uh, Kutsia and Boyd, Umpi Swat, Brandon Smith up behind him. Chicken flag. Well, the chicken flag is out. It was good racing, but that un unfortunate incident. So the results, Joey Ulz, Jason Kutsia said, Boyd, Yuri Swat. Oh, Jamie Smith, Brandon Smith, Valent Weyman came back, Nicholas Priyanas, Tivan Brock, Nico Zafrius, Michael Jordan, Gilsimus. I'm not disappointed. I'm just <laughs> super drained. Um, yeah, I had to give every single lap my all. Um, but yeah, well done to the people in front of me, Seba and Joey. They were really fast. Um, but yeah, game's on for the next one. Um, it was a good race. I mean, every lap went faster and faster. I was pushing to the limits. Um, but then I went for a pass on Joey down the main straight and he tagged my front wheel, which spun me, but managed to come back, gain a position, and I think I finished P3. Uh, well, this race we actually had a lot of pace. We fixed, um, fixed uh, f a few setups, which uh, a few parts on the setup, should I say. And um, it definitely paid off, um, and we were suddenly on the pace again, which was excellent to see. Um, a huge pity on the, I think it was second last lap. Um, I completely did not see Seb. Um, a pity that he got turned around from the incident, but to me, I'd, it's, I don't see it as my fault. I honestly didn't see him. Um, but a yeah, horrible incident on that lap, but uh, still great, great pace, um, and hope to carry it into the final heat. Okay, so what's next for you? Well, um, I think we P2 on the grid again. So hopefully we can again stay with the front pack, push away, um, and hopefully have the same pace. Um, yeah.
They split the tram lines. Lights off and we go racing. Turn number one has got the whole shot. It looks like it could be Sebastian Boyd with Joey also up behind him. Hello. Things are changing up here. Let's work this one out. Nope. Say boy, Jason gets here. It's Valand Wyman in third ahead of Joey Uls. Valand Wyman had a Red Bull on the lunch break. Here we go. Say boy, Jason gets here. Valand Wyman, Joey Uls. Right up behind him, Jamie Smith. First heat in the back, 14 to go down into turn number one. Jason Kutsia sits up there behind Sebastian Boyd. Kutsia is looking very racy. Boyd too. They're trying to get away. Maybe Kutsia is pushing Boyd to come, but let's get away from here. Two of us go party down there. Kutsia alongside Boyd. Boyd stays in one. Kutsia too. Kutsia is fighting up on the inside of Boyd. Don't touch, boys. It's going to get ugly. Boyd gets up there. Kutsia. Joey Ulls up to third head of Wayman. Up behind him there. It's Jamie Smith. Brandon Smith. Zephyrus. Jordan. Brock. Spanyanis. Where's Yuri Swart? What went wrong? It's the back of the field. He made a mistake. Yuri Swart makes mistakes? Really? Well, that's very uncanny and unusual of him. Sort of out of character. It's the back of the field. Keep an eye on Yuri Swart. He might do something spectacular. Put on a show for us. Come on, Umpi. Go, boy. Show us that you can ride cars. So everyone ahead of him is just as good, if not better. But uh, there we go. He shifts up a place. He's gained one place. We got uh, 13 laps to go. Keep an eye on Yuri Swart. Swart's up behind Spanyanis. He's blindingly quick, folks. He's a South African, won the recent Polo Cup Challenge. He won that one. He knows how to drive. Out front. Out front is Jason Kutsia, is it? It is. Kutsia leads out over Boyd. Ulls third, Wayman fourth, Smith five, Brandon Smith six, Nico Zafira seven. Michael Jordan, Devin Brock, Yuri Swart, Nicolas Spanyanis, and Gil Samus. Yuri Swart into turn number three is climbing the ladder. Kutsia comes Boyd. Boyd, Kutsia, and I think Ulz is joining the party. Now, these three had been at it all day, but in a very different style and fashion. Kutsia can win a race. He knows how to win. He's done it before. Swart up three places now to nine. Even Brock lays ahead of him. Swart gets his head down. He flies down towards turn number one. Swart down in... Uh, he's in six. He's moving up sporadically quick. Here he comes. Swart sits up behind Zephyrus. Nicholas has got his hands full. But in the meantime, in the front row, it's Yuri Swart. Here comes Seb Boyd up on the inside. Oh, oh. Across the bow of Boyd goes Jason Goodsea on a 40.2 seconds. The front row Goodsea gets away from Boyd. Also in third. <laughs> Brandon Smith looks over his shoulder and sees this uh, Luma green thing looming in the background. That is Umpi Swat. Mr. Brandon Smith, that is Umpi. If you don't know Umpi when he's lost his mojo, he's coming for you, lad. And he's coming fast. Swart up on the inside and drifts through to four. He is blindingly quick as Yuri Swart. And he came from the back of the field and finds himself in fourth position. He's going to go hunt the leaders. Umpi Swart is now taking everything out of his arsenal. All guns blazing. He's in four. Keep an eye. Nine laps to go. Look at him go. Yuri is determined. Determination is actually oozing out of that helmet. Kutsia leads out with Boyd and Uls. Here comes Swat. He'll get his head down at every opportunity. He'll come out, take it right hand in the main straight, and his head will go down with the wind behind him. There he goes. Behind him, Brandon Smith's trying to stay in touch with Yuri Swat. But Yuri Swat's got other ideas. He's going in search of the leaders. His head's down again, down into turn number two. Takes a right hand over three, the left looming. Brings it around. It's extremely strong in his forearms there. Brings that car to ride. Uses every part of the circuit to his benefit. It's a right handed out turn number five and gets it in Pini Cart down towards Cape Town Corner. He's breaking away there from Brandon Smith. Swat is going. Kutsia leads out. Behind him, it's uh, 
Sebastian Boyd, Joey Ulf, Jerry Swart, Brandon Smith, Dicker Zafiris, Michael Jordan, Nicholas Panyanis, Devin Brock, Waylon Wyman, who was right up there, is down in 10. Jamie Smith and Kilsimus. Well, what can they do is their maneuver. Yep. Seb Boyd gets through on Jason Goodseer. Seb Boyd takes the lead back from Jason Goodseer in the first of the 180s. Turn number five is out. We've got seven laps to go with the halfway mark. There goes Seb Boyd now with Jason Goodseer in second. Trying to keep Joey Ulz behind them. They don't want Ulz. But in the meantime, Yuri Swartz clear. Yuri is running a 40 second flat. Yuri is on, a, is on fire, folks. Literally, figuratively, not literally. Figuratively, Yuri Swat is blisteringly, blindingly quick. And on, everyone is hovering on the 40 seconds. Yuri Swat, the quickest, on a 40.103. So Yuri is flying. Oh, and there's a little bit of a chop up. And Boyd and Ulsa next to each other. Ulsa pushes through on Boyd, and Kutsia goes to the front. So Ulsa second. You don't want Ulsa second. But here comes Swat. Yuri is absolutely flying, folks. He's the quickest man on the circuit. Keep an eye on position number four. That Umpini, that uh, Daglo, yellow and blue card of Yuri Swat is absolutely flying. He is pitch, pitch perfect. 40,013 seconds. He is blindingly, blindingly quick. Jason gets here, back to the front there now. With Ulz, can Boyd come back at Ulz? He's got the arsenal. Keep an eye on the Swart. He's getting closer. Yuri Swart. Five laps to go. What will he do? Look at him go. He's trying to catch the leaders. He can see them and he can catch them. It's within his might. I'm not favoring him as a carter, but I know what he's capable of. Jason could see us back in the front. Joey Ulz, Sebastian Boyd. Here comes Yuri Swart and Brandon Smith. Brandon's doing a fantastic job in himself. Yuri Swart, four laps to go, he's piling on the pressure into turn number one out of one, he makes his way to two. The lead is going to two and here comes Swart, is broken away from Smith, Smith's got no retort whatsoever. Could see a leads out there with um, Joseph Ulz and uh, Sebastian Boyd. I think this is still going to unfold into a spectacle. Here comes Yuri Swart. And oh, Ulz is through on Kutsia. Ulz gets through on Kutsia. Three left left in it. Ulz goes down. Kutsia comes in. Ulz goes middle of the road. Goes defensive. While he's holding up the pack. Guess who's in four. He'll get close. Kutsia slides it in. And takes one back. And so did a Boyd goes to second. And Ulz goes down two places. Knock, knock. Who's on the back end of Ulz? It's Yuri Swart. Here we go. The race is on. Kutsia goes defensive, Boyd goes on the outside, Yuri looks for third, but Ulz dives on him. Swart has got some pace. It's going down to the wire. we got three laps to go. It's Kutsia, Boyd, Ulz, Swart. It's going to get fantastic towards the closing stages. This is the grand finale, folks. you got to watch it. It's going to be Kutsia, Boyd, Ulz. Keep an eye on Swart. He's going to do something clever up on the inside of Ulz. Is he going to make it stick? Ulz hangs around the outside. Swat sits with him. It's close. It's close. This is the way we go. Good see leads out here with uh, that man. And have a look. Semi Boyd gets beautiful drive and takes the lead back from Kutsia in the penultimate lap. Is Boyd going to do it? Boyd leads out. Kutsia second. Joey Ulz. And Yuri Swat. Last lap board out. Final lap of the day. Semi Boyd's got good seer. Ulz looks up on the inside. Umpri Swat goes around the outside, looks for the switchback. Sits up behind Ulz. What's he going to do? Ulz goes defensive. Yuri goes around his outside. Tries to switch back on him. Ulz goes defensive. But in the meantime, he's letting good seer and boy get away. Here comes Umpri Swat. Swat looks to go around the outside of Ulz. Ulz tries to keep him behind him. Yuri Swat says, You know what? You can have it. It's the last lap. I've done. What a performance. Ah. Turn seven. Seb Boyd, Jason can see the Cape Town boys lead out. Check it, flag looms. Ladies and gentlemen, it's the final lap of the day. Semi Boyd, Jason can see Joey Ulz, Yuri Swart, and Brandon Smith in the DD2 Seniors. Yeah, that was definitely the toughest race. 
probably one of the toughest I've ever done. Um, dicing the whole whole race with Jason and Joseph, um, but in the last few laps managed to pip Jason and get the victory. Jeez, yeah. Uh, if I thought that the second races were hectic, jeez, that was quite very hectic. Um, yeah, at the end I was just pretty tired and just holding on for dear life. Um, but yeah, well done to Seb, well done to Joey. Jeez, they really made it nice and fun. Um, yeah. Can't wait for the next one. Well, um, I have to admit it was quite an action-packed uh, last race. Um, we did have the pace, unfortunately we didn't have the legs down the main straight to take um, Seb. So we got slightly held up, I feel. But uh, well done to um, them, they drove extremely well, Seb and uh, Jason. Um, and I suppose on to Benoni.